got one of those, it took out one of ours, okay. Anyways, I'm watching a movie earlier called Live Escape, and I might do a video review on it. I'm so backed up on video reviews, but uh, so I watched this movie called Live Escape, and it follows these two cops who end up going to investigate an assault uh, and find out uh, uh, that the place that they're going, that they go to. There's some really weird stuff going on. And what they end up discovering is that there's a virus that uh, basically turns people into zombies. And uh, so they're trying to escape out the, you know, it goes to hell. And it's basically a lesser version of the movie Quarantine. Because that movie is freaking awesome. Just saying. It's a very enclosed, uh, very claustrophobic, well shot, well acted, just one of the best uh, movies in terms of like zombie movies. The Force will be with you, always. This movie seemed like they tried to rip off of that. It was very dark, very claustrophobic. There were some nice things to like about it. Like I said, there was the... Uh, they did a great job of actually showcasing how utilizing the environment, making it very feel very claustrophobic. Which I did appreciate that. I did like the way that it was shot because it was shown through their their handy cams. Uh, though at times it could get a little bit chaotic uh, due to that. Especially, it kept switching between the two of them, so something would be happening, and then it'll switch, and it'll kind of throw you off a little bit. But I guess you do get used to that somewhat. So, my biggest problem with the film was, I thought it was okay. I, I just didn't like the cops. The dialogue was pretty stupid. How they acted was seemed pretty dumb. And I get that this is a situation that they're not used to, but the problem I had with it is they're cops, so I would think they'll be a bit more objective with how they're going to deal with the situation. But they don't, they're pretty, they do a lot of pretty stupid stuff. And I was like, come on, and, and then they end up, you know, learning that, Making a lot of noise might not be the smartest decision. And then they make a lot of noise. Drawing constant attention. There's a whole lot of unanswered questions. And and that could be a good thing. But just the way the movie does it, it, it felt very generic. And again, uh, like I said, I had a problem with the characters because I just thought they were poorly written. I thought they sucked uh, as oh, cops. I didn't buy oh, them. Yeah. Always. I, they, they, I didn't buy them as cops in the least. And I'm not saying that cops shouldn't shouldn't make mistakes or they should know everything. You know any. It was situation, but it just watching this movie like, why are they making these decisions? It's stupid. Republic is in control of a command post. And even how it ends, it's stupid. The zombies themselves didn't have any any distinction. At some points, they felt like they were uh, they moved fast. Sometimes they felt like they were just slower for no reason. And then they kind of did this thing where 
they went 40 something minutes without seeing a zombie and then all of a sudden you see like a hundred zombies come out of just nowhere, there's no build up. And just ultimately I just thought the move was disappointing. They was kicking out, but Maul just dropped too. Oh, they took all of them. I couldn't even respond. 